Hello folks and welcome to episode 3 of Crafting with Craft. Today's sponsor is Taskade. Here's a little bit more about them before we jump into what's new with Craft. This month here on Keep Productive, we're sponsored by Taskade. Taskade is an all-in-one collaboration tool for working faster, smarter and together. I followed their journey since the early days and I've been impressed with their product that they've built. Taskade isn't just for your task, it helps you manage projects with a range of views. They collaborate together in real time, even through video. You can use templates and workspaces to create your own notes, documents, mind maps and much more. So you can change a collaborative task list into a mind map by click of a button. Taskade is used by small to medium sized teams for working together, but it's also a favourite amongst personal users thanks to the flexibility of the tool, allowing you to create everything from a bujo to a powerful to-do list. Each project as well supports chat and video conferencing too. You can get Taskade below for free, available on all of your devices, and for teams, pricing plans start at $5 per user per month. Thanks again to Taskade for coming on as a sponsor. So, in this edition of Crafting with Craft, we'll be overviewing a brand new feature that Craft has launched. We're actually caught up with new features in Craft. So, it's a calendar daily notes experience, which is something that actually works really well inside of Craft, in my opinion, after playing around with it for a little bit of time. So, it's very simple. On this left hand side, you have three core areas documents, and then you have calendar and search. So they've really slimmed it down on the sidebar. But if, for example, you click on calendar, you can connect your calendar. I believe it's with the default experience. So in this case, Apple Calendar, but I'll include some information below if I am wrong. However, I was able to connect up my Apple Calendar. You can customize it a little bit. So for example, you can bring in stuff like with Google, you can turn off certain calendars that you have um, and everything comes in like that. So the preferences options are really good. Once you've got that set up, what will happen is at the top, you'll be able to see your full month ahead and you can even skip to today by hitting the dot. Now, what's nice is you can create a daily note for each of those days and it actually separates itself from, for example, all the documents you've already created inside of Craft. So you won't actually see it in the all documents area, you'll see it only in this left-hand sidebar. It'll be searchable through the search bar, which is good. So if you have made any notes or connected anything, then you can do that at still and it will be able to be searchable through your craft account. Now, what's really nice is you can do two, one of two things. You can create a daily note, which is essentially a journal. And what's nice is when you go in, you can actually scroll back to a certain date. Um, it's essentially your journal. So it's a nice addition and you can still use the craft editor as you would with all the colors, grouping, cards, pages, and modifications in Markdown. But you can also go ahead and select a note. For example, uh, if I have a script and write day here, I can see it in my calendar. If I want to, I can go to it, but I can actually go ahead and create a meeting note. So this is perfect because I can start typing away uh, on this meeting note and what it will happen is when that day comes it will actually pop up and I'll be able to see any meeting notes that I find relevant. So this is perfect for agendas, meetings, planning and connecting stuff inside of your craft account. So all in all this new update is actually a really decent addition to craft. You've got the ability to create a journal like experience without it interrupting on your document uh, layout that's on the first page. You can also start doing what you do inside of say agenda and note plan to start planning ahead for meetings and even making, making notes or adding nice uh, additions to any event that you have. For example, if I uh, wanted to, I could add a few pictures from the day from a meeting with my sister. So it's actually quite nice uh, in the, in, as a concept to be able to have, um, be able to make meeting notes and be able to use as a journal. So Craft is slowly adding these great additions and it's really easy to do this. The update should be available from the when we post this video. Um, so we'll make sure to include what, what's new to overview that. Anyway, folks, thank you so much. Please do make sure to subscribe and we'll talk to you all very soon. Cheerio.